Hi Tango Dancer, would you like to make your tango more rich and would you like to know more the essence of this dance? If yes, this video is for you. Uh, in this week video we have a guest teacher from Argentina, Damian Garcia. Uh, Damian Garcia is a tango teacher and tango dancer that is performing and teaching all around the world but he lives in Argentina and he has been teaching in Argentina for many years and we are very happy Damian uh, for you to be here uh, with us today in London uh, and he's going to share with you some tips uh, to make your tango more rich. Thanks Pablo Anand for the invitation, for allowing me to share these ideas with your members of the Tango channel and yes, the idea will be try to develop a little bit more of Essencia Tanguera, see, movements and details with a lot of tango, see, that will allow you to make your dance richer and more playful and connected with your dance partner. So the first idea will be to try to don't show your fancy movements, don't show your big repertoire of movements or that particular musical interpretation that you can do that soon. To really arrive to the point in your dance in which you really need to do that step or that musical interpretation. So now the question is what to do to not to do too many steps in one dance because sometimes we see in other dancers in, in one dance they throw so many sequences, so many steps and that's why um, Demian is going to share with you uh, some tips that will help you to, to stop doing that. So the first tip to get this will be to hold or stretch the movement by stepping, just touching the floor and taking several beats for transferring the weight and then maybe some other beats for collecting and if we can do that that takes all the musical phrase would be great. That will make a big difference in your dance. And now I will show you two examples of this with the music. Tip number two, to play with your partner but not stepping always to air at the same time. I will show you some examples of this. Yes? So I start doing the side step with her in front of her. Now I hold my partner, I support her there. I do a side step and I face her and I will bend her by increasing the flexion of my leg. And then I get out. Okay, so now I will get a nice follower so that you can see this. Pablo, please come. Here we go. Vamos, música. just two examples of these tips, but for sure you can explore this in different parts of your dance. Ok, I hope that you have liked this and that you really put this in practice and you will see how richer we can your dance. Thank you very much Demian for, for these tips and we really hope it's helpful for you and really when you start adding this, this concept in your dance it's going to make a big difference and your tango will be, become more rich and more interesting. So if you like our videos, please like it and share with your tango friends. And if you want to sign up to receive our videos uh, every week, uh, we are going to put a link in the, in the comments below this video. 
and you can join the mailing list and you will receive every week a new video with new tips, uh, with guest teachers and we are going to keep helping you to improve your tango. Uh, thank you very much for watching and please keep learning and keep sharing your dancing because the world of tango needs your embrace. Thank you and see you in the next video. Bye bye.